poor people that lived above the building that I was hustling for that called the police on the line to try to make some money to feed my daughter. And all the niggas in the struggle, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> So a lot of people worry when they cut that they're going to lose a lot of strength and you probably will lose a little bit but if you focus your main compound lifts on your strength sets and you have the mindset that you won't lose strength, it will help a lot. Um, I haven't noticed any strength decrease in the three and a half weeks, obviously I'm not that deep into the cut. I have still another six weeks, but you know, if I lose a little bit, it's okay. It's not the end of the world, so don't let it get to your head that much. Oh, I don't need no music. Thanks for coming in, Drake. As far as extra volume during this cut, really, I mean, I've been training like two days per body part for a while now. The only thing I'm really doing extra is adding probably one extra set per body part. So for back day, adding one extra back movement, biceps, one extra, and I'm incorporating drop sets a little more than I used to. So other than that, it's just consistency and having fun. Luckily, like I said, everyone's cutting and everyone here is focused on gaining size or building a lot of muscle and then a couple of us are focused on like building as much strength so it's a good balance to kind of keep everyone in line. I've been spitting a lot in my videos, man. It's like oh, look, at this, look at that vascularity though, dude. No, the other one, the other oh, one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Yeah, but I look, I look like this. I looked like this when I was like 12 years old. I've always been vascular. You know what I find interesting is everyone's like boosting their deadlifts like 600 pounds or whatnot. But we've all been curling the same weight the past like five years. I mean, I could throw up like some 45s or 50s or like some alternating reps, but. That's because you're not a 5%er, dude. My biceps are so small, dude. I have like the worst insertions, too. <sighs> <sighs> Call me long insertion. What is that like? Ten inches? We're back at the block. Peter can't keep me away from this poke, dude. You can't stay away this from is anything Asian, dude. Dude, this is gonna be some good poke, man. Oh, really? You like that? Just now getting home, I'm gonna do cardio tonight, but I have to pick up a very, very important package. All right, see you in the morning. So in this box is Peter's birthday present. He is turning 28 years old, and basically what he thinks is happening is that his girlfriend is purchasing the Sony A6500 for him, because that's what she told him, uh, which is a big birthday present. Uh, A6500 is basically a step down from this camera, but what is actually happening is Everyone in our group actually chipped in and we are getting him the Sony a7s II. So that is what is in here. He thinks he's getting an a6500. He's actually gonna get this. He is gonna be absolutely blown away. I'm really, really excited about this. So that'll happen tomorrow for me at dinner. So enjoy the rest of the video, but get ready for that. So stoked. Launch day. <laughs> I am up early, I'm all dressed, ready to go, having some breakfast. Um, instead of having my shake this morning, I decided to have some cereal so a little quicker so I can get over to the office. Honey bunches of oat with strawberries and milk that smelled kind of funky, but you know, whatever. What's Happy up, birthday, right? dude. Why are you here so early, man? Did you sleep here? Yeah, bro. I had to finish a video and it didn't even render. You know, I got you lunch yesterday, but I think because it's your birthday, I'm going to get you lunch again, dude. Thanks, man. What are you doing? Yeah, I'm, I'm, playing, I'm playing Clash, man. <laughs> dude, Stop, dude, I'm losing! He plays game all the time, it's so lame. Losing. So I just got a call from DHL. All of my shirts are coming in about 15 to 20 minutes. Guess what happens in 15 to 20 minutes? It's the exact time of launch. And I knew this was gonna happen. I was like, right at launch, right when I have to like be on the computer and make sure all the technical things are going smoothly, that is when 51 boxes are gonna get delivered. And sure enough, it probably is, so. <laughs> Woo! What do you think about that, Louis? See, catch me outside, Louis. No, you don't. You don't do that today, okay? And here we go.
So Peter's girlfriend wrapped the box up. This is the shipping box. Then inside, she basically printed out like a 6,500 pictures, taped it to that box. So he's gonna open this after he gets back from dinner, but I'm gonna go lift. Front squats today, 225 pounds for sets of 10. I'm trying out these new three quarter sample compression pants I got with the gold print. Now I know that three quarter length pants are really, really popular, but personally, I think I'm a fan of a full length. But you don't want to be like kicking wing, kicking ass. Good stuff. This is the good stuff. Snakes and sparklers are the only ones I like. Well, that might be your problem. It's not what you like, it's the consumer. It's not about you, it's the consumer. What movie is that from, guys? <laughs> How did my cast look in this, man? Was that good? Object? Apparently, should be a long. Apparently, we're a three quarter if you ball. If you're a ball, if you ball, ball's life. <laughs> Late night date with Daryl, Chick-fil-A. How excited is Peter gonna be for his gift? Super excited. I'm jealous. Yeah. I don't even videography stuff. I'm gonna be part of YouTube soon. Yeah, Daryl is essentially a core part of my channel. Look at that face. Happy birthday, dear boy. <laughs> Ooh, nice camera. A7S. That's not a 6500. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, bro. Thanks, Thanks, man. Birthday. 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 It's this is from everyone Paul. everyone chipped in and instead of the 6500, we got you the A7S2, bro. Thanks guys. Uh I did not expect that at all. I was I thought I was gonna walk into Peking Duck and I thought I was gonna see everyone. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> so when, he, when he only grabbed two menus, I was like, all right, no, no surprise. So see, now you can actually teach me how to use this kind yeah, of Yeah, dude. See, Max is excited because now he has two angles. Yeah, now I'm gonna borrow that one too, so I can have one set up on the gimbal and one, <laughs> okay, one like yeah. this. Now I can do that, yeah. Day 1006, Maserati owner, still nowhere to be seen. It appears the local townsfolk have now tried to see if the owner was hidden under the grime. They weren't. Day two, it still smells a little funky. It was a gift by our buddy. How is it? It was hard to track. It's awesome. Yeah. Actually, I had never even heard about it until I talked to Peter. He said that they couldn't find it anywhere around here, so I made it my mission. Thanks, man. Yeah, no I want to thank you guys so much for the crazy support on the compression pant launch. I'm so excited for you all to get them and experience the feeling of the stretch around your legs. I think you're going to love them. Every single order that was placed on launch day and up until about 4 p.m. the next day is going out. Domestic, international, all of them. So let me know how you like them. You didn't think I was going to end the video without trying this, did you? Have you tried this? Uh, yeah. Is it good? I thought it was good. Are you drinking a cold one? Yeah. I mean, it's just a, a grape colored, purple flavored drink, man. It tastes kind of like. It literally just tastes like grapes, grape soda. It is good. 
Tastes like grape soda. You know, if this was a sponsored video by Monster and I liked it, I'd be a sellout. But because they didn't send me this and I like it, I'm real. I actually, JK, I don't really like this that much. I don't really like grape soda. What? Who loves grape soda? Peter loves grape soda. Is it true? Mm-hmm. What's that from? I don't know. What's You're that? old enough to know that. I do, I do, I do, I do. Oh, uh, Keenan and Kel. That's it, man. Hit thumbs up button. See you guys later. Uh, let's see. Today you're watching this. It's Saturday. I leave on Thursday to go fly away to go visit my boy Michael Corey. And then I go visit Gooma. The Goomba. The Lord Gooma. <laughs> By the way, you guys like this hat? This hat actually was my dad's. So, very, very special to me. My stepmom gave it to me. Kind of, she was actually, she actually moved out of, no, I'm not gonna get too deep into it, but this is my dad's hat, so that's why I'm wearing this. See you guys later. Thanks for watching. Link in the description to save self 10%. Boom! Just kidding, it's not. Hey, dude, uh, really important question. Um, for tomorrow's video, uh, it, it involves getting Peter a gift that he didn't know what it was. Would you recommend I call the video, he had no idea? Or? No, that's it, dude. I just want your, because you're, you're the best of the titles, dude. <laughs> yeah, but I don't think it's a good title. You don't think it's a good title? Yeah, I think it's a bad title. He had no idea. All right, what would, what would uh, you? Why would he do this? Because he, he, we got him a camera, he didn't know what it was, so he had no idea, dude. If you put he in it, no one's gonna care. Oh, oh, so it's gir gir any girls? You can't use he. Um, hmm. Why not? She knew all of them. The surprise Ooh, gift? <laughs> I would say, like, he had no idea. Did you buy me some of that? Yeah, we all chipped in. Yeah, that's a good gift. Uh,. Really he had him. no idea. <laughs> you took it Unexpected surprise. <laughs> um, caught him off. It caught, caught off guard. Caught off guard. It, yeah, caught off guard. Or I don't know, man. It's hard. Hmm. All right. Well, I'll do my best. I just wanted your opinion on it, bro. <laughs> yeah, totally. Okay. All right. Bye. All right. Thanks. Bye.